everyone. Welcome to my channel. Um, I'll quickly like to share with you that WhatsApp now has um, a feature that allows you to share your screen, just as you would have on Zoom, Google Meet, WebEx, maybe Skype, and some other virtual meeting platforms. So I think this is a very good one from WhatsApp. They want to be a 360, you know, digital um, media platform, and that's good for them. However, there's only one bot you would need um, WhatsApp desktop. That means you need to be on your computer, and the other person that you're sharing for also needs to be on their computer, and they should have WhatsApp downloaded as a desktop, desktop app. So without further ado, I'll just show you like a sample. Although here I'm calling from a mobile phone to my desktop. So I'll do that right away. Um, let's see. So another bot to that is you also need, so as you can see, I'm placing a call now. So do that. I'll do that. I'll place a call and I've re received the call. I've muted because the echo is coming back. So what I'll do is you need to share, like to switch on your camera and both devices need to turn on their camera to have video stream open for this facility to work. So I'm doing that right away. So I need to accept on my other device. Yeah, so notice the share screen icon. Start screen sharing, I hope you can see that. And then now once you select, you should be able to start sharing. There are two options, the share window where you can share just one particular tab on your window. It could be maybe your Word document or a Gmail, Yahoo Mail, some chat, Slack, YouTube, whatever you want to share, or you could share a whole screen. So what this means is that everything on that screen that you have selected would be sharing. Like in my case, I have to display, I have my desktop display and I have an extending monitor. So for the purpose of this video, I select just this. So once I do that, notice that I can already start viewing the screen here. So although my mobile is saying um, screen sharing is not supported on the device. So like I said, both devices need to be um, desktops and you need to have WhatsApp desktop on your device, I mean on your computer. So, But this is just an introductory session. We don't know what WhatsApp will be bringing up next. Maybe they'll make it a full-blown meeting platform. We don't know what that would be like, but we will await any surprises that they have. Of course, it would be nice if we can get more minutes for meetings.